Scary moments today on Panama City Beach as beachgoers attempt to rescue a little girl who was caught in a rip current in the Gulf. She was rescued by a woman, but the adults who also tried to help out found themselves stuck in the rip current. News 13's Emily McLeod joins us live now on the beach. Emily, witnesses say everyone on the beach out there pulled together today to get the swimmers back to safety with a human chain. Yes, witnesses say it was truly a community effort. Everybody came together to make sure everybody was out of the water safely. Now I'm told by witnesses that had they not formed that human chain, today's events could have ended very differently. They say it all started with one girl swimming in the water. She was out there, she was crying for help, and then one woman did go in to rescue her. The first woman that went in did come out safely with the child, but there was a second woman that followed her in, and she was the one that eventually got stuck out there, prompting another gentleman to go out there and help save her. That's when two other beachgoers saw the gentleman and the second woman out there in the water struggling, and then all four of them became stuck. And then that is when Ryan Stelmacher's wife, Brianna, got the idea to form the human chain. An entire group of people went out there and pulled together to get everyone that was stuck in the water out there, and Ryan Stelmacher went out there to use a raft to attempt a rescue, but he says every time they made a step forward, the water would immediately pull them back out. He says the entire experience has, ta has taught him that Mother Nature is no joke. Because the, we've been here all week and there was double red flags leading up until yesterday and then you know today it was a single red flag but this has been the worst conditions by far since we've been here. Earlier today, single red flags were flying out here on the beach, and while I was out here, they did end up changing them out to double red flags. Reporting live in Panama City Beach, Emily McLeod, News 13, Panhandle Strong.